Hi everybody on this bright sunny morning and welcome back to another video. Um, sorry I haven't done this for a few months. Um, first of all because my craft room was in carnage because I was reorganising it which I'll be putting a video up about that shortly. And then secondly because um, I didn't get a kit in June uh, because I live in the UK. There was a bit of a mix up when Spellbinders launched their brand new Spellbinders UK website which is brilliant because it means you can order straight from the UK and the shipping is faster, cheaper etc. Um, so I'm super excited about that and I was going to stop doing these but then I missed doing them so here we go. This is my, it's just arrived today which is the 14th which is about two weeks earlier than when I was ordering f direct from the USA. So that's brilliant as well. So uh, my new thing is I'm going to have a very quick scoot through the total package, which I subscribe to every month. And um, quick scoot through that. And then I've, I've made a promise to myself that I am going to start using all of the card blanks that come in this kit in the card kit of the month so um you get 10 card blanks every month i end up just stocking them all up in a big pile so every month now i'm going to do a very quick un um, unveil of the club kit of the total package and then i'm going to make two sets of five notelet cards um which i'll do on camera so this is the spellbinders club kit for July 2022 and here we are it's all magic this month so there's my 10 card blanks and envelopes which will be getting made into a a um a, a two sets of note look cards um so I'm not gonna go through every single one you've got your where's the little doodah here it is so what we've got this month is um, 10 cards and 10 envelopes, 9 pieces of cardstock, 10 dies, paper pad stamp set, alphabet stickers, chipboard embellishments, gemstones, well that's good, that's a new one, die cut shapes, foam squares, adhesive tape. So that's what's in the kit. Oh look at them, aren't they lovely? Gemstones, that's a... That's, uh, a new edition, all in beautiful colours that will go with this kit. I, I really like them. I'll be using probably some of them. Um, there's the stamp set. It's all about unicorns and fairies and magic and sparkle. So that is uh, fab. That's always going to come in handy. Chipboard embellishments. I'm not going to take these out of the packet. I will do that when I start, when I get into, the, but these are all just a lot of different die cut shapes. There's your puffy letters. Oh, I seem to have been given two stamp sets this month by mistake. Um, here are the die cuts which make these, um, these mermaids here. Um, that's what they make. The, obviously the adhesives. Let's have a look, quick look at the colour of cardstock, gold, under the sea colours, yeah, pink, all the pink, all the pink, purple, white, that's far, that's all pinky, purpley, blue, fairy colours. And then let's have a quick squeeze through this. Um, I'm no doubt going to be using some of the, um, put that there so it doesn't stick to my cardstock, using some of this in the note look cards this month, which is what I normally do. So we'll just have a very quick flip through. Beautiful pink fishtail gold foil. Nice. Nice. Oh, that's bunny. Oh, how lovely. That is gorgeous. 
gold foils and fairies and a nice kind of um, ombre effect there. Flowers. Oh, that's gorgeous as well. That's gorgeous. Roses. That's lovely. Have to change the direction. Um, see related stuff. I love the colours. I'm loving the colours this month. Anchors and a bit of wood planking, which obviously never comes in wrong. That's funny. That's a nice bold, but pretty flower paper oh i love that i love that it's like text and and a bit of foil as you can see i'll just catch the light that's bunny gorgeous colors in this paper pad oh lovely marble striped foliage So pretty look at that i mean that how rich those colors are that's fab so right so that's the card kit um that's that's how that's how quick the uh reveal's gonna be and then the other stuff what color foil have we got we have got rose gold which is beautiful to go with the glimmer of the month which is add a stripe of color so this is your glimmer plate and then that's your cutting die so you can put your that on i mean i, I suppose you don't have to cover it all but it's just going to add some lovely uh foiled stripes to your project so that's the glimmer clear stamp and die of the month is called have a chill summer it's got a big ice lolly as we call them in the uk have a chill summer, sunshine, good times, anything is popsicle. Hope your birthday is sprinkled with happiness. You're my favourite flavour. Happiness is ice cream on a summer day. You melt my heart. It's a good day to be happy. And a nice little bit of texture for your lollipop stick as well. Strawberries, slices of fruit. Um, and there's the matching die set that cuts out all of those. So that's them. Small die of the month which is day at the beach this is um this is what what it makes a lovely like somebody sitting on a beach towel it's got a bag it's got some flip-flops um and a fringed beach towel which you can make striped or not swimsuit it's cool that's cool i might have a go with that um apg die of the month which is tiara trifold got what we got hello there nice florals as usual that is just so versatile you can obviously it's in one two three separate pieces there four separate pieces so you can use it cut it however you like um and then that's just a little top of thing so yeah that's the uh there's the example that they've given cool large die of the month food truck so it's got a taco and it's got an ice cream it's got a bit of awning for the front this is your truck body it's quite a good size that and all your bits for your truck um and there is the example i'm liking the taco not that we have taco trucks in the uk but and then the embossing folder of the month which is geometric stripes um which is just really kind of you can use that for anything um so that is the kit total package for the month of july 2022 so, so here's a quick look at the five cards for this month i've gone ahead and done all the die cutting and panel cutting off screen so it's going to be a real quick whiz through so here we have um a strip from the pattern from the paper pad which is two and one eighth by five and a half 
um, just stuck to the front of the card with some liquid glue. I've chosen one of the embellishments and added foam pads to it um, just to give it some dimension. And then I've also die cut the Hello die from the um, APG die of the month and cut it out twice, stacked it and put it on and just stuck it onto the front. For this one I took a panel which was three inches wide, five and a half tall. I ran it through an old embossing folder that I had just because I chose the a star sentiment and, and I wanted something that was a bit kind of starry uh, in look. So I'm using some um, double sided tape to attach that panel to the front of the card. Super simple this one but I really like it, it's clean. Again I put some foam adhesive behind the sentiment which came from the embellishment pack again and and i've added a foam pad behind each of these two little stars which also came from the embellishment pack and that's all there is to that one for this one i've cut some smaller panels i mean you can make these whatever size you want i've used the lilac card from the card kit and some of that beautiful paper that i absolutely loved uh, from the card kit i just love the colors in that it's fabulous stuck those down to the card front with liquid glue and then from the embellishment kit i've taken three of the sentiment strips i've backed the you're amazing with the same lilac cardstock that's on the panel I put foam tape behind them all and just attached them to the card and that's it that's another one done i'm using the small die of the month here um and some of the patterned I used the turquoise from the card kit and also some of the patterned paper from the card kit to cut out the um, all the bits and bobs I put some the the towels glued flat the the bag and the um, hat have got some liquid glue on the bottom and one foam pad up at the top just to give it a little bit of dimension. I like the way the hat sits because it lifts those, um, the hat, the scarf that's attached around the hat, it lifts it up high. And I just love those flip flops, they are so cute. And then from the um, stamp set of the month, stamp and die, I've used the stamped out Have a Chill Summer, used the die set to cut it out, and there's the fourth card done and then finally I just love these lollipops they're awesome so I've just used three different colors of cardstock I haven't stamped them I've just die cut them uh, four different colors if you count the the lollipop stick done a bit of stamping in a complementary color cut them all out and then did the anything is popsicle sentiment so here's a very quick look at the note look cards that I did using the April and May kits. So this, these are the ones from April. I just used five different bits of the paper pad and then cut out some large white die cuts. Um, I love this paper hugs one. It's my favourite beautiful paper and back the paper hugs sentiment with some vellum just so it stood out. So that was April. And then a real quick whiz through May, which are basically just embellishments and pieces from the paper pad, apart from the final one where I used the die kit, uh, the stitching die, and did the Hello You, and some of those beautiful bold sequins that came in the card kit. Um, so that was it. That's it for um, today. And thank you so much for joining me. I hope you've enjoyed it. This will be a regular feature from now on, a uh, quick unboxing and five note look cards every month. As always, it's been a pleasure. Uh, bye for now.